Hello friend, today we are going to learn about Daya software. Daya is a design editor, diagram designing editor, uh, just like Microsoft Visio, uh, and it is free open source. Okay, so we are going to use it. So you can download it from uh, Daya's website. Daya's website, if you do in Google uh, search Daya editor, you will get this Daya installer day file and go to the site. On this site, you will get this Daya installer which is available for Mac, Linux, and Windows. Uh, so, you can make the open source, so JNU general public, it can be used for diagramming the tools. Download the software and simply double click on the installer. The uh, system will get automatically installed on you. Simply have to press next button uh, for the installation. Now, let's go and create diagrams using the Daya software. So for creating the diagrams using Daya software, you simply have to uh, go and see this uh, Daya software here. So we are going to choose uh, the Daya software. Uh, Daya software is uh, selected. Here you are on this user manuals in PDF format as well as in CHM automatically uh, installed. So we are creating this Daya software here. Daya software is just like this. So for this Daya software, you are on this user interface. This is the mark. Uh, selector symbol here you are in the text uh, menu symbol and these are the magnifying editing text editing you are in the scroll and bound diagrams and likewise we are going to create one diagram here uh, in this diagram you are in these many sheets which in which you can create many uh, diagrams here so let's say uh, we are going to create a simple diagram here let's come consider there is an uh, home okay a sweet home so simply put this sweet home here uh, it's not look like a home but it's okay uh, this is another home okay. you are having this and this home is with the computer this home is not with the computer this is what you are saying let's say you are having this man here rushing to his house and here you are having and standing uh, by his house so this is simple diagram we created now let's see they are required to have some road and likewise you can draw that so you can have this in the city government buildings home office and something so in the same way you can draw the uh, road and other uh, diagram so let's see who we, we are going with this assorted to show the road so let's say this is a road we are showing here Not with that, we are going to show this road is in this rectangle diagram. Okay. So, consider uh, shown this road expanded here. Okay, road is shown. So, uh, now this diagram you are on this DIA extension. So, simply you are set, saying uh, this as a save. So, in save, we are giving this a name home. Okay. home name is given and it says save so this is saved as a home dot dia which is editable uh, if you save it into png or jpg format it is not editable uh, but you can't save in, in a jpg png format you have to export into that now we are going to make some changes here uh, prior to that we say uh, okay let's say suppose you are having uh, some you uh, think okay and consider uh, that okay just say one person like this uh, having some added okay something added there and it says save so save is there now go to the file and then simply say export so when you go export, it will ask you for the home.png, you are saving it in pictures. Here you get the all options for uh, this uh, export options. I uh, personally like uh, Cairo PNG with alpha, so I am saving it with uh, that extension. So I am saying this is save and image is saved. I already have one uh, some images here in pictures folder. Uh, created with Daya. This is web server image. Now you have this home image and likewise. So 
just for uh, easiness i am once again repeating the entire process click on the new so you get the new uh, workspace here we get the diagram 2 dot dia now draw the diagram that you want just by dragging and dropping things here okay if you want to connect them use this line tool and connect these people with the thing that you want to run like this you can add many other symbols for example you can use from these electric symbols these symbols and likewise you can use that and you can drop here and then you can use these symbols to create the circuitry you can go and you can even create the database so you can draw and drop this table and other things here so you can get the database and likewise diagram then when you create such a diagram uh, simply save it as okay we are saving it so save at i'm saying this is a test so i'm saying this is a test diagram test to dia and say save so see file is saved export this file for usage into your uh, reports and other things and give this as a select the type here is selected pyro png with alpha so it's saved as a test too so this is how you can create diagrams in the dia and something but when you go on closing the dia uh, simply say file quit okay like this and so we are having this diaster um, now i'm requesting you that if you like my tutorial uh, kindly subscribe to my channel and give the like uh, don't forget to like it and also uh, uh, click on the bell icon so that you can get uh, the information about my newest studios and likewise thank you